Hey, Omarion. We're here to see your gym and fridge. Hey. Peace and brightest moments to all. We gonna shake it up. We gonna do a minimum. I ain't even gonna tell y'all. Let's warm it up. Let's warm it up. All right, it's gym time. How often do you work out? Uh, I work out five days out of the week. The weekend, we rest. What's your favorite exercise? Probably pull-ups. Yeah, that's my favorite exercise. You know, it builds the kind of strength that, you know, not everyone can see. If you can do a lot of pull-ups, you don't just appear to be strong, you are strong. What do you consider to be an intense workout? Heavy weight and high reps. What's one exercise that you hate? None of them. I, I don't hate exercises, I love them. How do you prepare for tour? Well, it depends. It depends on what I'm preparing for. You know, when I'm preparing for tour, I have a specific regiment because usually I'm in rehearsals as well. So um, I treat my rehearsal more as a fat burner. What keeps you motivated? Health is wealth. <laughs> Life itself. I think uh, in order to maintain a good perspective, you have to be healthy. Life itself motivates me to um, continue to you know, work out. What kind of training do you do? I definitely implement some martial arts, some boxing, swimming, cycling, anything that gets the energy up. What are your fitness goals? Uh, to pretty much just maintain uh, um, a functioning physique. You know, uh, not something that just looks good, but uh, that is good. What type of music do you listen to when you work out? Always mixes. DJ Papa, Orion Orion. I listen to uh, Thunderstone Labs. Just a wide variety of music that help me tap in. How does working out help you as a performer? Well, it definitely uh, helps me manage my energy better. You know, I heard this quote once. It says, 30 minutes on stage is comparable to a nine to five. You know, so 30 minutes on stage for me is literally a full day's of work. So um, I make sure I eat right. And, um, you know, I make sure I, I keep my energy high. How do you keep your mind fit? Well, exercising is relatable to life. You know, a tough exercise can actually prepare you for tough situations in life. And, um, you know, if you get through a tough exercise or a challenging workout, then uh, whatever challenges happen in life, you can get through that too. That's how I stay mentally fit. All right, Omarion, what staples do you always have in your fridge? One of the most important things in my fridge is spinach. Spinach is so important to Old Smoothie, which is actually the um, first meal of the day for me, usually. Old Smoothie, eat it. How has your diet changed throughout the years? My diet has changed tremendously over time. I think that uh, maintaining a good diet is, is the key to having great abs. You know, a lot of people wonder where good abs come from and it starts in the kitchen. What did your diet look like before you got fit? You know, just like yours. Just eating whatever, you know, at any given time. That's what it looked like. Not too good. What would we never see in your fridge? You will never see pork in my fridge. Sorry to my pork friends, but ain't no pork in here. What do you eat for breakfast? Exactly what I'm about to show you right now, okay? I'm gonna give you these key ingredients. Oh, smoothie. We got some frozen pineapples. We got some spinach. We gotta get the ginger and the cranberries, okay? This is, this is old smoothie, all right? Y'all ain't never seen this one. Do you cook? If so, what's your go-to dish? Yes, I do cook. I think it's important for all the men out in the planet to be able to cook and uh, feed yourself. What's my go-to dish? Probably jerk shrimp, smoked salmon, you know, a side salad, some rice, because it's nice. That sounds good. What would you never eat? Probably won't eat any veal, any uh, duck, any dolphin, a shark. Yeah, nah, that's not for me. What's your go-to comfort food? Definitely soul food. Fried red snapper, mac and cheese, you know, stuff like this. Do you eat red meat? No, I do not. Do you drink coffee? Nope, I don't drink any coffee. I drink tea though. I like tea. What's your snack strategy? It depends. It depends, you know, it depends on what I'm doing. Cause when I go ham, I go ham. I've been known in the past to have a sweet tooth. So I try to manage my sweet tooth by, you know, uh, instead of maybe 
when I make my own smoothies, maybe I'll go and visit Jamba Juice. I just have a healthy, you know, all right, if I'm gonna get it in with the sugar, if I'm gonna have some cake, I always make sure I put it in a hard workout after that, for sure. How do you keep your healthy diet when you're on the road? Uh, it's not easy. I definitely travel with my blender. I travel with my blender and I make sure that I get my smoothie in every day. Do you drink protein shakes? I used to drink protein shakes, but this is my protein shake. I make my own protein shakes. How do you treat yourself? If I had, you know, an intense work day and I'm feeling like, you know, I could treat myself, which is what you're supposed to do, you know, um, maybe I have some ice cream. I, it's guilty pleasure, I just have to be honest. Or if you take a look right past my shoulder right there, you'll see the biggest watermelon you ever saw, okay? Watermelon. Yeah, I have like some watermelon, some fruit, something like that. That's, that's a good healthy snack, you know what I'm saying? What do you do on a cheat day? I cheat, you know what I'm saying? I, um, you know, I eat everything. I eat everything that is looking good to my eyes. Yeah, whatever that is. Ladies included. Ha, oh, Marianne. <laughs> do you take any supplements? Oh, yes, yes I do. I take, it's, it's the maca, but what we call ourselves is a maca faca. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta be a ma maca faca. You know what I mean? But this is real good. Maca root. Oh, it's, it's basically for men, you know. In, in your nuts. You know what I'm saying? You know, if the ladies love you, you know, you need to be supporting yourself and your energy with some maca. Yeah. So, this is the famous O smoothie. Is this a secret to your abs? Now, you know this takes discipline, okay? You can't have abs if you ain't got discipline. Bon appetit. Cheers. All right, it's rapid mm. fire time. 7 a.m. workout or 7 p.m.? 7 a.m. Squat or deadlift? Deadlift. Favorite song on playlist? Can you hear me? Crossfit, yay or nay? Yay. Pull ups or chin ups? Pull ups. Dumbbells or kettlebells? Dumbbell. Run on treadmill or great outdoors? The great outdoors. Cardio or weights? Weights. Big legs or big arms? Both. Biggest compliment, jacked, ripped, cut, or swole? Ripped. If you could work out with anyone in the world, dead or alive, who would it be? Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson! Hey, so thank you for coming to tap into my gym and fridge. I hope y'all have an amazing day. I'm about to uh, continue my day, get my thing going. So thank you again. You ain't got to go home, but you got to get hell out of here. Peace. <laughs>